Welcome to Advanced SE Linux System Administration by Sven Vermeulen, a course by Pact Publishing. My name's Mark Thomas and I'll be the presenter for this course. Sven Vermeulen is a long-term contributor to various free software projects and the author of various online guides and resources. He got his first taste of free software in 1997 and never looked back. In 2003, he joined the ranks of the Gen2 Linux project as a documentation developer and has since worked in several roles, including Gen2 Foundation trustee, council member, project lead for various documentation initiatives, and project lead for the Gen2 hardened SE Linux integration and the System Integrity project. In his daily job, Sven is an IT architect in a European financial institution, as well as a self employed solution engineer and consultant. Also, he's worked as a web application infrastructure engineer. Do you have the crucial job of protecting your private and company systems from malicious attacks and undefined application behavior? Are you looking to secure your Linux systems with improved access controls? Look no further, Intrepid Administrator. This course will show you how to enhance your system's secure state across Linux distributions, helping you keep application vulnerabilities at bay. This video course covers some advanced SE Linux concepts and shows you how to leverage SE Linux to improve the protection measures of a Linux system. You'll learn to work with container and policies to harden your system. Now let's talk about what this course offers you. The first section, SVIRT and Docker support, clarifies how Red Hat has devised the secure virtualization technology and implemented it on both operating system virtualization and containers. This section learns how to tune these services with SE Linux support and control resources between the guests or containers. The second section, DBus and Systemd, goes into the realms of the core system services and how they use SE Linux rules to further harden their own services and features. With this knowledge at hand, administrators are then shown how to tune the DBus service controls, as well as handle SE Linux access controls enforced through Systemd. The third section, working with SE Linux policies, looks at tuning and controlling the SE Linux policies themselves. It shows how custom policy enhancements can be created or even replace the distribution provided policy. In the fourth and last section, analyzing policy behavior, we'll dive into the analysis tools that allow engineers and administrators to query the SE Linux policy in more depth to assert for themselves that the policy is contained and behaves as expected. Sounds amazing, doesn't it? So, to begin with, you just need a system running Red Hat Enterprise Linux version 7.3 or any latest one. Along with this, you also need Fedora version 26, which we've used at a few instances. By the end of this course, you'll have a better understanding and working with SE Linux technology. You'll have a strong hands-on experience by going deep into the architectural and functional framework of SE Linux. You'll be enlightened by knowing how SE Linux can be positioned to enhance the security of Linux systems and Linux hosted services. So let's begin this journey together and I hope to see you there.